Hi, I'm Kiernan Shipka. Hey guys, I'm Gavin Leatherwood. I'm Jazz Sinclair. And I'm Lachlan Watson. And we're gonna play Who's Most Likely To. Lachlan is most likely to go all out on Halloween because they are so good at makeup. It's absolutely ridiculous. I think all of us are likely to go all out on Halloween, but Lachlan has the added benefit of just being an impeccable makeup artist. Oh man. I'm gonna have to go with Kiernan here. I feel like Kiernan's got such a uh, poise and elegance about her and her life is just kind of cool. And I would totally tune in and watch it. Uh, she's a great role model for plenty of young ladies and people in general with a certain discipline and, and who she is. And um, uh, I feel like people would benefit from watching Kiki's Life and other things. That's what it would be and called. And that's what it's called. It's Kiki's Life yeah. and other things or in parentheses? Kiki's, I like yeah. it. Okay. Kiki's Life and other things. Tune in. That's a really funny question. Okay. Are you allowed to say mm. yourself? I was about to say. <laughs> me? Would I want to be me? It might be me. Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. I've done this with you. <laughs> you do? <laughs> a 16 hour work day, one text message. Who's going to win? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get by me. <laughs> I think it's a toss up between me and Jazz because I think we actually did get into some magic <laughs> offset. Um, mm -hmm. We got up to some shenanigans, maybe conjured a, a thing or two. So I'd say it's a toss up. Oh, uh, Luke Cook, absolutely. Because sometimes he just makes decisions that really throw you off. <laughs> like he'll just go up or down on a word and it just, it, it, it changes his entire sentence and it's just so funny like he's just so funny and he always takes risks especially when the camera's not on him like he really gives it his all i feel like jazz is probably one of the most romantic types on set for sure she feels with her whole heart she always was kind of that that person to look up to when it came to romance and sentimental and in, in the feelings kind of stuff anytime there was some sort of uh emotional personal turmoil, Jazz was kind of that, like, um, there was a warm, nurturing, uh, ooey-gooey kind of feelings that Jazz emanated. Maybe Michelle Gomez, because she's a whole <laughs> ham of a person. And I would watch the heck out of her TikTok. I would say that Lucy and Hilda are different, but have just the same warm, nurturing, I can tell you anything quality. Uh, not to say that they're they're similar as individuals, but I do feel like their essences are very similar and like comforting in nature. We all know um, this. Yeah. Do we? Oh, we all know Sarah this. Carton. <coughs> Who? Melvin! <laughs> oh yeah, but of course. Of course, of course. What a nerd. Yeah, Tyler Cotton. I was gonna say me too, because I, I had one that actually got lost in the rain. It was like a big box of comic books and they got completely lost. Something you guys didn't know about me and I know you were dying to know this. I do, I am a big fan of comic books as well, but when it comes to being the champion of comic book nerds, it's Tyler Cotton and we love him for it. Maybe Lachlan Watson. It might be Lachlan Watson. You're a poet. I think that you know it. Um, Probably Lachlan. I think I just should, I took journals, I journaled it between like every single take we did. So I should just publish the like, the highs and lows of the, the chilling adventures of the chilling adventures of Sabrina. Mm -hmm. Also Jazz, the fact that you just said you're a poet and you know it is like very <laughs> ironic. I really loved that moment. Thank you, thank you. Bye, Bye Sugar. Thank Bye. you.